sa, sa, G. Hope you guys are all doing super well. Today is May 30th, 2019, aka Game 1 of the NBA Finals Raptors versus Warriors. Who you got? Comment down below. Obviously, I'm cheering for the Toronto Raptors. Even though I don't live in Toronto, I'm always there. It's the closest team to my city, so it's a given. Please, for the love of God, the only way the Raptors are going to win is if Steph Thompson, Clay Curry, and Kevin Green get injured in the first game. Otherwise, we are oh God knows how many championships they win. They don't need another one, so I'm wearing this jersey all day. Hopefully, we can come out with a W. But I would love to see what you guys think. Who's going to win, Raptors or Warriors? Comment down below. But today, we are going back 25 years until when I was just a little Asian boy, and we are going to be taste testing every fast food kid menu. I, oh, I said that wrong. Every fast food kid's meal. I just came back from four different places. We got McDonald's. Burger King, Wendy's, and A&W. And I'm gonna rate these all in three different categories. First category is gonna be taste. Does it taste good? Does it taste bad? You know, on a scale of five. Next one we're gonna do is nutrition. How healthy is this meal? Is it diet day friendly or is it just like off the deep end? This shit is terrible for your body. And finally, category number three is the toy because one thing I did enjoy as a kid is collecting the toys. I remember an Inspector Gadget dude, it had like eight different parts. So Perfect score would be if they get 5 out of 5 on each category, which would be 5 times 3 is... 5 times 2 is 10. And then just add 5 more, so it's like 11, 12, 13. A perfect score would be 15 out of 15. So here is every kid's meal. I've lined it up perfectly. Let's see if that looks good. Hell yeah. Right off the bat, just looking at it, um, I can tell which one is the most unhealthy. A and W. Why the hell are you giving a full-size soda drink to a kid? I don't know. They didn't have any other options. And also from looking at it, I would say the healthiest. Well, I can't really see inside the bag, so it's just the drinks. It's either the milk or the apple juice. And I'm gonna say the milk has less sugar. 12 grams of sugar. And this apple juice has 31 grams of sugar. That's like a Coke. So McDonald's is looking the most healthy. It might get five out of five on that, but probably not. Let's try these out and get fat and naughty. Not a good start for nutrition, but let's open it into this bag. So what it comes with is a small fries and a baby burger. I didn't believe it, but this is actually called a baby burger. I don't know if parents are bringing their kids to A&W to eat because this isn't really healthy. Nothing on the bun, one little thin patty of meat that's so thin, and then what's under this? Ketchup. Just ketchup. I can't see this tasting very good, but cheers, here we go, A&W Kids Meal. Ew, so plain. There's just nothing going on with this. They need to make the patty just a little bit thicker. Like, you can't even see it when I hold it like this. You just see the bun. And maybe add a little bit more condiments. Where's the mustard? Where's the pickles? Where's the onion? But I have to think this is a kid's meal. You know, kids are picky eaters. They don't probably don't like onions or mustard. So I see why the only condiment on here is ketchup. Now let's try the A&W fries. Now I know these are good, so I might it might save the rating. Mm-hmm, hell yeah. a and fries, one of the best. Mm, very flavorful, not too potato-y. And I love that some of the fries, let me see, still have the skin on it. You know, I like that. Mm, you're lucky a and your fries just saved the goddamn day. Root beer. Can't lie, a and root beer is very good. We are gonna give it a nice, Two. It would be zero, but you're lucky you have those fries, okay? That's what got you the points. Okay, uh, nuts, aka nutrition, there's just not enough room. Um, very bad. We're gonna give it a one. And the toy? There's no goddamn toy in the AW's kids' meal. My G, zero. Zero for the toy. I was shocked when I was like, uh, does it come with the toy? They're like, no. I was like, Okay, you're weird. So out of 15, NW has his three. Holy shit, this is bad. Let's move on to the next. First of all, this bag design is the best. Definitely attracts the eyes of kids, so they're happy to get this bag. Let's see what we got from Wendy's. Ooh, okay. 
Okay, Wendy's. Initially, I thought this was an apple pie, but looking closely, it is the toy. My G, it's a DIY design your ride. This is looking good, Wendy's. You might beat out McDonald's on your toy. Let's see what we got in here. Oh, it's bare pieces. Look at this. What kid is not happy as hell opening this? This is what I'm talking about. This goes like, and then this goes here. Wait, what? Oh my god. I'm 28 years old and I'm struggling to build a little kid's meal toy. How does the roof attach? I'm confused. Boom! We got a nice jet tortoise. Does it roll though? This will definitely keep your kid busy while you try to eat too. Amazing. Okay, let's see what else we got in the kid's meal. Wendy fries are Again, amazing because they're salty and these fries also have the potato skin, which I love I think I just have an addiction with fries like it's really hard for me to come by a fast food fries and say it's trash You know, I wonder if they put more than just one condiment We will see the bun is definitely thinner, which I like I don't like too much bread just ketchup again So this is just common amongst all of them. They only F with ketchup Mmm, mm-hmm, yes, yes, mmm, thank you. I could see myself eating this every day as a kid. They know how to make the perfect ratio between meat and bun. That was delicious, as you can just see. I scarfed that down in 20 seconds. The bun was soft and buttery, and to wash it all down, we have 100% apple juice. <laughs> oh my god. I can't even drink that. Just take it easy. If you're a parent and you're bringing kids to Wendy's, don't get them the apple juice. Just say, can I have a, a cup of water or something? It's way better, and the overall experience is gonna be good for your kid. Because if they're drinking this entire thing, congratulations, you played yourself in the next two hours. They're gonna be bouncing around the walls, no doubt. Easy, I'm giving it a five. It deserves it. <sighs> it's pretty healthy, you got the fries, the burger, that's just normal, but the sugar and the juice, Why'd you do it to me, Wendy's? You get a two. And last but not least, the toy. <laughs> easy, easy five. So Wendy's is ending off with a very strong score of 12 out of 15. Next. Ugh. Yo, right off the bat, it has some girth to it, you know? like. I'm gripping it nice. It's nothing. First thing I feel in here is the toy. Okay, what is this? I don't know what this is. Let me know down below. I think this is from a movie or something. Maybe the one with uh, Kevin Hart in it. It looks kind of weird. It's like a chicken, a duck, or and a rabbit all in one. I don't know. Does the toy do anything? Or wait, no. N not not only moving your arms. Is that's all it does? Okay. Uh, great toy. No potato skins. So, not as good as the first two, but these fries are definitely more on the potato-y side. Bun is different. It has sesame seeds on the top. Let's uh, lift it up. And oh, oh, okay, Burger King. It's got ketchup, mustard, and pickles. So far, you're getting your bang for your buck when you come to Burger King. Mmm. Mmm. Yo, this is exactly why I need to go to Burger King more. Just get that char broiled taste like you, someone just made it out of barbecue or something. Easily my favorite so far. Mm. And you know what sucks? We only have like one in Ottawa, but we got like 40 McDonald's. I don't know man, Burger King needs to make a comeback because this is delicious. The bun complements the meat so nicely and just the extra condiments, the mustard and the pickles, I know it doesn't sound like much, but it really does just give it that extra mmm. I'm so happy. Healthy, not a Coke. All right, Burger King, taste, you get a five. Uh, nutrition, we'll give it a four. Toy, no assembly. This dude only moved his arms. I mean, it is good durability. You won't break this, like, yeah, it's not gonna break. We'll give it a two, you know? It's not that great. It wasn't anything like the Wendy's one. Very nice effort. You came up with 11 out of 15 is your final score, Burger King. Thank you so much for participating.
If this isn't iconic, I don't know what is. McDonald's is just so smart with their packaging. You got the smiley face right there. You got the low-key branding up here. You still got the golden arches. I didn't even notice this now. You got games in the back. You can punch these music. Oh my god. So not only do you get a toy here, you get a nice educational thing for your kid to learn. No, and on this side it says do the chicken boogie. It's fully showing you choreography to do a dance. You got the receipt. How much did this come up to? Under five dollars, four dollars and ninety-two cents, and your kid's happy. He's fed, and he's getting smart, and he's losing weight. What is this? A box within a bag. These are called ugly dolls, and look at that. Look at that. It shows you every single one you can potentially get. So as a kid, you want to collect them all. I think this is a coloring book, maybe. I don't know. Okay, we have a lot of stuff here. Stickers. You love stickers as a kid. Amazing. Next up, we have. What is this? Bro, look at this. This is like a whole like stage or something. I don't know what's going on, but I think you build it with the box because there's like imprints in here. <laughs> I don't know what I'm doing. Is there like a freaking DIY manual or something? What? I'm so confused. Is this the dude's house? All right, um, McDonald's, you needed to give an instruction book because I'm 28 years old and I don't know what's going on here. Probably color the stairs right here. Color orange, okay, this is fun, this is fun. And then turn it over here, turn it purple. And then turn the pencil and color it blue. But everything else here, je ne sais pas quoi. I don't know what's going on. So we're gonna move that aside, okay? Apple slices, rather than fries. This is the first time we're seeing that. Mmm. It comes with a freaking yogurt as well. And you got your burger. Okay, you're getting way more than everywhere else. Let's see if it tastes good though. Oh. Okay. No, and it landed on the burger too. Pretty delicious. If I was a kid, I would love this. Moving on to the burger, it looks like whoever made this was definitely doing the blindfold challenge. It does have a pickle, ketchup, a little bit of mustard, and oh! Like, like four little pieces of onions at the bottom there. So that's not bad, you're getting your bang for your buck, but how does the McDonald's burger taste? Just like Burger King. You know when you take a bite into their burger. And I think this is the only burger that had the cheese in it. It comes with cheese, which is usually always an extra charge, but I guess with McDonald's, they're making so much money, they're like, here, take your slice of cheese, you big fatty. And that is all in the box. And to wash it down, we have a milk. 12 grams of sugar? Is this a milkshake? But wait, it's got some vitamin D, calcium, and vitamin A. Okay, so this might be the healthiest drink we've had so far. Ugh, I haven't drank milk in like four years. I know this is probably good for you, but I don't like milk. I like chocolate milk, but just plain white, I only like it in cereal. Am I bougie? I think I'm a little bougie. But now we are rating our final score for Taste McDonald's. I am giving you a nice solid four. For nutrition, you didn't have the fries, you had apple slices. Oh my God. Five. Last but not least, the toy. It came in a box. It was very promising. It had a coloring book. It has a freaking exercise for your brain and a choreographed dance on the side. Five. No, I gotta change my mind. I didn't even understand the toy really. Uh, Three. That was a last minute change, but it had to be done because I didn't know what was going on. If there was a manual that showed me, that would have gotten a five. So looking at the final score of everyone, a and W came dead last with the... <coughs> <laughs> with a total score of 3, Burger King came second last, unfortunately, with a score of 11. And coming in first, we have a solid tie between Wendy's and McDonald's. They scored 12 out of 15 each. McDonald's could have easily taken the win because a 28-year-old... <coughs> a 28-year-old Asian boy couldn't even figure it out, so... Comment down below who you think has the best kids meal. Is it Wendy's or is it McDonald's? Anyways, thank you guys so much for watching that video. Comment down below what I should try next. You want me to do the adult menu, the seniors menu? Yeah, you didn't know there was a seniors menu? There is. Smash that like button with this thumb right here on your right hand, the thumb, if you are watching this video on your phone. But until next time, I will see you guys very soon.